Initiative 976 is on its way to being passed across Washington. In Spokane, 54% of voters said yes, compared to 45% voting no. The measure is to reduce card tabs to just $30 with no additional taxes or fees. But that means Spokane loses about $3 million in revenue. Our mayor can watch working for you with what the immediate impact will be from this measure. Local governments around Washington will have to get creative with their way to find money once I-976 passes. It's tough because you'll certainly save some money on those card tabs, but the streets you drive in may just take a hit. Nobody enjoys paying nearly $100 on their car tab, especially when they have no clue where that money is even going. Now voters have made a choice, reducing car tabs to $30, but at what cost? So that means that we will have half the money available for residential street construction, which means we're going to have to reduce those projects. The city says that revenue from car tabs accounts for about $3 million in revenue, so things like residential streets, bike lanes, and transit may take a hit. Political watchdogs, the Washington Policy Center, say it's now up to the cities to find a new avenue for those costs. They still have the sales tax and, and other tools at their disposal, but the key, again, is that they need to, if they feel that those, those are priorities for the city, for the residents of that city, they need to go to those residents and talk to them. Right now, Spokane doesn't have any replacement dollars to make up for that lost revenue from car tabs. Well, um, there's no money in our budget to add an extra $3 million. So so if, if our council members wanted to consider asking voters to raise taxes, we could, we could look at something like that. This is a statewide initiative, so it could even affect funding for projects the state is paying for. There's investments that the state is making directly in our community, like the North Spokane Corridor. And so we don't know if um, funding for those projects might be impacted as well. Now, I asked Mayor-elect Nadine Woodward's campaign if she had any plans once this measure passes. I'm told she's disappointed that it did pass, and once she's in office, she'll look for other revenue options. Reporting live in studio, Mayor Kawash, 4 News Now.